Hey everyone and welcome to today's video. So this is my second time doing this video because I was just 10 minutes talking to myself really because my camera wasn't recording. So uh, I've already undone, opened everything because I thought it was recording. So unfortunately no unboxing in this video today. So I do apologise for that. But what has the postman brought today? So brought me a couple of things. One for my dad which I'm not going to show. Uh, but uh, over the past few days, I did pick up a few things in CEX, and I picked first off. I picked up R.L. Stein's Mostly Ghostly. So this is another one. I've got three of these R.L. Stein movies now. I think there's another couple. I think there's another one I can get in this country, and I think the rest of them are in America. So there's the back, and. I'm really pleased to have got this one for just 50 pence. So, next, I went to CEX and I, I bought these two seasons and checked the discs in town. And the discs were in an appalling state, so I took them back and I got my money back. So, it's been bugging me, you know. So, I asked them about the discs and said, we've cleaned them. Would you like to see? So, I said, yeah. So, they look okay now, so can I buy them? So, yeah, so I bought them. So I bought season six and season eight of the X Files. Now, the last two discs of season eight aren't brilliant, but I can always take them back and get them rebuffed again. But I'm really pleased to finally have season six and eight. So I'm sorry about that noise in the back. Neighbours cutting down the hedge, but uh, again, really pleased to have got them. So, the postman came this morning and brought a DVD. The disc was loose inside the case, so I had to quickly open it to check the disc. Unfortunately, it does have a, a mark on it, which I'm disappointed with, because uh, I really wanted to watch that disc. And it is Sherlock Holmes, the Jeremy Brett version, the elementary box set that contains three discs. And uh, it has five episodes on as well. And it has The Hound of the Baskervilles, The Sign of Four, The Master Blackmailer, The Last Vampire, The Eligible Bachelor. And has a runtime of 510 minutes. And then we have the discs there. So that's the disc that was damaged, that, that was loose inside the case. It really bugs me that does when it's factory sealed and a disc is loose. Next uh, is Blu-ray. A little bit disappointed with it because it doesn't come with its slipcase because I've got all the other ones on the shelf behind which do. And it is The Hobbit, The Battle of the Five Armies. This one's come from CEX because I had a voucher and uh, I ordered it. Shame it didn't come with the 3D lenticular, but uh, I'm glad to finally get this and watch the extended edition because it's the only one that I didn't have. I am currently cleaning two of the discs, so they're on the floor with polish on them. So can't show you them just at the moment. But we get five discs and we get two discs for the 3D. We got half the movie in 3D and the other half of the movie in 3D. Then we get the full extended edition on 2D on one disc. And then you get your bonus features on other discs. But as I said, I'm just currently cleaning them at the moment. And finally for today is this Blu-ray. And it is another Eureka Blu-ray. Number 100. And 82 and it is the private life of Sherlock Holmes never seen it but I watched the trailer and I was impressed by the trailer I thought the movie looked pretty good so uh, I've ordered it and this one is stars Robert Stevens as Sherlock Holmes and Colin Blakely as Dr. Watson. 
we have the back there. It tells us about the movie and the extras that we get. And a few screenshots there too. And it's on for 125 minutes, made in 1970. In colour. And it was directed by Billy Wilder. I like Billy Wilder. He directed uh, Some Like It Hot and The Seven Year Witch with Marilyn Monroe. I love them movies. So I'm sure I'll love this one too. So we, all, we extras we get are a 50 minute feature the missing cases deleted scenes uh what else do we get commentary with christopher lee uh, the trailer and a 52 page booklet as well so interesting so just show you the booklet first so there's the booklet cover and we get a lot of text in this and some nice pictures too oops some nice there so I'm pleased about that there's the disc and if I just remove the disc we have some art under the screenshot of the movie so yeah this does look like a good blu-ray a good movie so I'm looking forward to watching that so all in all not too bad really so what I picked up and the mail so pleased about them so that's it for today please give the video a thumbs up comment down below with whichever one of these you like or whatever and uh, subscribe for more videos and until next time take care and thanks for watching